Hey everybody, it's Kim from CouchPotatoCamping.com. Now, have you had a horrible night's sleep in your RV recently? Or you happen to lay on the bed in your brand new RV and realize that that mattress is not going to work more than one night as you are camping across America? Well, I have been there, we have done that, and we have an easy solution. So I'm about to share with you 10 of the best reasons to be using this inexpensive, affordable and easy camper mattress upgrade that you can do regardless of what RV you have, whether you have a truck camper, even in boats. I promise you this solution is going to be amazing for you. So we are here in our Intex Soul Horizon trailer. And for us, there was two big reasons we needed a camper mattress upgrade. First of all, the moment that we laid down on the factory installed mattress in the horizon, I knew that it was not going to work at all. And what we found out was it simply was at that time, like a three inch slab of polyurethane foam. And that is it. So there's no way that I'm going to sleep on just three inches of a polyurethane foam mattress. It was horrible and not, not comfortable at all. So when I went to look for mattress options, different mattresses to put in our Soul Horizon, what we found out is that we could only have something that was eight inches thick max. And that is because in our specific camper, um, I have a blackout shade right here, so you might not be able to see it. But this is where the window stops and then you have the mattress. So if you had a mattress that was more than eight inches thick, it would go over the window, which obviously is not something that you want. And trying to find a mattress that is comfortable, that is eight inches thick or less, because we also have a system underneath that I will link to below of how to prevent mold underneath our mattress. So we have to account for that space and that is two inches. So what we ended up needing was a very comfortable six inch mattress that would work in an RV. And do you know how hard it is to find a custom mattress that will work in those dimensions and is not a price point that scares you off? So when I say that I know from experience what it's like to try to switch out your RV mattress and to be just trying to do different thicknesses and make sure it's comfortable, make sure it's in your price point, make sure it'll work. There's a lot to think about. And this is by far the easiest solution that I found. And it is using mattress toppers from Naturally Nestled and making a custom mattress. And it's super easy. So I'm going to share 10 ways or 10 ideas, 10 of the best things about using this system. So number one is you can create a custom firmness of a mattress. And that's a big deal because a lot of times it's like you only have like a firm option or you don't want to buy a mattress and get it and discover that you really don't like the firmness, but you don't have a return policy or it's like, you know, a big deal to return. And what I love is that Naturally Nestled comes in two inch and three inch mattress toppers. Now I talked with the company and they so thankfully sent me some mattress toppers to review to create that custom mattress that we are using. And I have to say, I'm very thankful. So what we did is we got three two inch thick mattress toppers and kind of put them on top of each other. We got one in soft, in medium, and in firm. So three different thicknesses. So I assumed that putting the soft mattress topper on top and then having like a medium and firm was gonna be the absolute best mattress that there was, case closed. If I had bought a soft mattress, then that would be it. I mean, that it would have been the choice and we would have had to deal with it. And our first camping trip, we discovered we did not like that firmness. It was actually too soft and actually just caused some back discomfort for myself just simply because I have some issues going on with my back. Um, so that was surprising. I was not expecting that. So thankfully, we were able to just flip to the medium firmness on top and the soft firmness 
in below. Um, so that's like the middle layer and it works so much better. I love having that option because again, like everybody knows trying to buy a mattress online, it's kind of disconcerting. It's like, you don't know what to do. Do I want a soft firmness or I want medium firmness or I want firm? How medium is going to medium? Is it airing towards firm? Is it airing towards soft? There's a lot to consider and it's like, you know, not a small purchase. So I love this system of being able to customize what you want and not having to return anything. It's so easy. <laughs> now, the second reason that we love this custom mattress upgrade is because again, you can customize the thickness of the mattress. Now I said that we needed a mattress that was eight inches or less. You might have a totally different thing. Uh, you might need something that's only six inches or less. You might have a sky's the limit and you can have like an 11 or 12 inch mattress and you know, good for you. <laughs> I mean, that is like goals, right? But a lot of times if you have a smaller RV, you might be constrained by the um, thickness of the mattress. So in our case, we were able to do three mattress toppers on top of each other. Uh, you could do three, three inch thick mattress toppers and then you'd have a like a nine inch thick mattress and that's not including any mattress underlayment you might be using for mold control again i will link that video below because mold control especially if you have a mattress like we do that is enclosed on three walls um, and there's no airflow you really do need something underneath your mattress regardless of what type of mattress it is to prevent mold so um in that case like being able to customize the thickness and what you need is super important. So you're able to do that and it works fabulously. All right. So the third reason that we love this system, I'm just going to go ahead and say it. It's the cost. I have done a lot of research on beds and I specifically love airing towards natural and organic beds because the chemicals coming off of more conventional beds, let's say, really affect me. And I just, I can't lay on that all night long. So when you're trying to find like a natural or organic bed, it's expensive. Just no, no <laughs> there's nothing around that except for when I found naturally nestled and they are surprisingly cheaper than even the cheapest ones that I had been using before. I mean, the cost is great, especially when you consider that it is either 100% natural latex or 100% organic latex. Um, and then it comes with a cotton cover included. And that is rare. Usually you can find like a good price point, but then they get you with adding the cover. It could be like another 75 or 80 bucks, which, you know, really impacts the price. They have the cover included and you do want the cover because I've made this mistake again in the past of trying to like save money. I mean, I don't need the cover, no big deal. Yeah, you do. Because trying to put sheets on latex with no cover on it is just an exercise and frustration that you don't want. You just really don't want it. Um, also the cover protects the, the mattress, you know, so you want to protect your investment, getting the cover included in the price the price point is not that bad. Again, I'm going to put affiliate links below, um, which means I might make a commission if you buy a purchase, but honestly, I, I recommend this product completely across the board because I know how hard it is to find inexpensive yet really effective mattresses. So I'm going to put that link below so you can check out the price, um, and customize it according to the thickness that you want and the firmness. And you can even add different covers if you wanted, like a quilted wool cover. If you want a little extra softness or a little extra, I don't know, um, wool is naturally antibacterial or antimicrobial. So that might be good for you. So yeah, cost is number three. It's a big one. Um, it's one of the reasons why I really love recommending this compared to going out and trying to find a bed in a box, like an actual mattress. Those can be expensive as well, especially if you need to customize the size. And that brings me into the fourth reason why using these mattress toppers from naturally nestled and combining them is a great idea because I have had a mattress topper 
on a short queen RV bed in our other trailer that needed to be obviously shorter than a standard size queen. I ordered um, a latex mattress topper and I found that if you cut it with an electric knife, you can trim off that extra um, excess that you don't need if you have a custom size RV and you can easily do it. And then you don't have to pay for the customization. I mean, it's a smart way of saving money and you can do that with these mattress toppers as well. So even if you need a queen short, a king short, you know, all, even if you have a size that you can't really state um, that it's queen or king short, but it needs like a curved edge or any of those things, you can customize it yourself and save so much money. So that is the fourth best reason to be using the mattress topper system to do a custom mattress upgrade in your RV. All right. The fifth reason that this system works really well is because it is not that heavy <laughs> to get these products into the RV and to pick them up. Now, if you have ever ordered a bed in a box, and I've ordered many before um, in many different homes, and every single time trying to get it inside your home or up the stairs is a beast. And it's super heavy, especially if you're getting a memory foam or a latex. Those are heavier than if you're going to be doing like a spring mattress. Now, trying to get a bed, if you were to get a mattress that was like a nine inch thick mattress in a box and then trying to get it through your RV door and up the stairs and maybe around like a tight corner. I mean, we all know if you're living in an RV, you know that it's not that simple. So if you can get rid of that frustration and reduce the weight of the box and the size of the box, it really can help you out, especially if you have any sort of mobility issues or any problems with lifting weight. Now to put it into context, again, we got three queen size mattress toppers. I was personally able to pick up the box, which I've never been able to do before with a normal size mattress. They weighed about like 20 to 30 pounds, roughly in there. But the box was so much thinner and smaller, so it could easily pick it up the RV steps and bring it in through the door. Now, if we had had a normal queen size mattress, probably would have been between 90 to 100 pounds in a box that was much bigger. Um, obviously much thicker. The length probably wouldn't have mattered, but it would have been thicker. Again, you could probably do it. I mean, it's not that it's inconceivable. It's just a lot easier to do it in three smaller boxes rather than one huge box. So that is important as far as getting the, R um, the mattress into your RV. Now, the sixth reason that we love this system is because if you need to get in underneath your mattress, once all of those toppers are on, it's so much easier than trying to pick up a huge, like 10 inch mattress that might be on the platform under, you know, over where you need to get. Now in our Soul Horizon, underneath our mattress is all the water and like all that stuff that we need to work on. So anytime we need to winterize, de-winterize, do any of that stuff currently, we need to work on some electrical stuff that is also underneath the bed. So every time that we need to access that, the mattress has to be lifted up and to stay up. We ha don't have the ability to necessarily keep that weight like levitated, you know, halfway up. So we can easily take off a mattress topper and put it over there on the dinette to kind of reduce the amount of weight that we need to lift up. We could take them all off easily. Um, take off a topper and roll it up rather than trying to roll up a nine or 10 or 11 inch thick mattress that obviously does not work well. So that's something to keep in mind. If you need to access underneath your mattress, how heavy is it going to be once you put your mattress in there? And just the ability to take off mattress toppers, you know, one or two at a time or all of them, but make it easier than removing an entire mattress it really is smart. All right, reason number seven that this is a smart system. Now, if you put your RV in storage or if say down the road, you decide, hey, RVing isn't for me, 
or you sell your RV and it's going to be like a few years before you get another one. Having mattress toppers stacked to make your custom mattress works so much better because you can take those toppers and you can then put them on the beds in your home and just make them fluffier, you know, and you don't have to like store a mattress anywhere. If you actually have a full size mattress, if you don't have a bed in your home that needs a new mattress on it, um, you, you're just going to have to leave the mattress in the RV when you sell it, leave it when it's in storage, which if it's cold or wet or moisture is an issue, could really be kind of nasty. Um, you don't want things to happen to your mattress and to get damaged. So I love the ability to just take these toppers, take them off and put them on beds that are already in the home, or, you know, you can roll them up more easily. Like I mentioned before, roll them up, secure them with some string, and you might be able to just prop them in the back of a closet, corner of a room or something. It gives you a lot more flexibility to be able to keep your bedding, keep it in good shape, and to not have to worry about it being so big and clunky. All right, so number eight in the best reasons to do this custom mattress upgrade. That is because, like I said, there is a zippered cover. Now, if you have pets, if you have kids, um, if you just really concerned about keeping your mattress in as good of shape as possible, it's really great to be able to take off that cover, wash it in hot water, sanitize it, get rid of any stains or spills, um, pet urine if there, if there was a problem with your pets, you know, having an accident, it's nice to be able to clean your mattress. And again, you can't do that with a big one. So you could take off all of the covers if you want, or just the cover on the top topper, put that in the wash machine, wash it well, and easily sanitized. All right, reason number nine, and that is this system works for us. I wanted to really put this through the test before I recommended this. Um, we had our first outing and obviously the firmness didn't quite gel. So we mixed it up and I had to wait until our next outing and that was going to be a 30 day trip. And I really wanted to be sure that after 30 days of sleeping on this system, I could actually recommend it. And I do. So it was a long time in coming and reviewing these mattress toppers, um, creating this custom mattress, but I wanted to know if I could recommend it, if it would be comfortable, if the mattress toppers would stay, you know, firm for a bed situation. And I do highly, highly recommend it. Again, like I said, this is what we're using in our Soul Horizon. It's a smaller, um, RV, but we have used a mattress topper option before in another RV and it did work as well. So we do highly recommend and stand behind um, this solution as a really great solution for campers. And finally, number 10, and that is this works for any RV, any truck camper, um, but even if you have a normal size bed in an RV, you can get whatever mattress you want. You might want to just add a mattress topper to make it softer rather than getting an entirely new bed. And this is what we did in our other trailer. We had the really nasty factory mattress. It was an inner spring one, but it had like blue floral flowers all over it. It was old. In a, in a new RV, but it was just like old looking. Um, that bed was completely unusable. However, at the time, we didn't have the money to be getting a new mattress. We didn't quite have the time either, or, you know, just all kinds of factors going on. So I just ordered a mattress topper, a three inch latex mattress topper. And don't you know that just putting that three inch mattress topper on top of the existing factory mattress, made it so much more comfortable. We never found that we needed to order a new mattress. Um, that was it. It was an inexpensive fix. We already had the base of the factory mattress. So all we were looking for was that comfort level that was on top and this worked. So if you have a existing mattress already, you're not really wanting to completely get rid of the entire thing. Just get a mattress topper, see if it works. If it's not enough comfort, 
you can get another mattress topper. <laughs> you know, you can continue to stack them until perhaps you just have the stack mattress toppers and you get rid of the factory mattress because it's so much more comfortable. And again, like I said, it's a system that works. All right, so that is how we created a custom mattress for our RV that was on a budget, is super comfortable, highly recommend. If you've done anything like this, please let us know in the comments below. If you've ever had to trim a mattress topper in order to create a custom RV size mattress, go ahead and let us know too. I think everybody would be really interested in hearing what other campers have done in order to create a really restful night's sleep because you do, do need to get a good night's sleep every night. Um, don't, don't skimp on that. Treat yourself. You're out there enjoying nature, you know, being on the road. You really do need to be comfortable and get some restorative sleep. So again, I'm going to put the links in the description below. Check those out. Um, if you have any comments about creating a custom RV mattress or what your options have been and what your solutions have been in the past, please do share those in the comments. If you're just now finding our video and you're not a subscriber, we would love it if you would become a subscriber. We have all kinds of videos showing simple ways to make camping more enjoyable as well as a lot of campground reviews. We try to do a review of every place that we stay, as well as other helpful information for first time campers or campers that just want to live a simple life and enjoy being out there in their RV. Until next time, everybody, I hope you take care and happy travels. Bye-bye.